We're looking for um, exotic or nat unnatural to your environment plants. Um, they're actually really easy to find. And um, if you were to go down by your uh, local tracks or uh, anyway, right now we're on the side of the freeway and we're studying vines. And um, these are some vines that we've been studying for a while. And these are uh, English ivy which is a common vine everywhere, and uh, people actually buy it. Um, that'll kind of go against, kind of against God theory, you know, it's a worthless thing. I mean, you have a, uh, well, I'm not going to bother, but, you know, all, all of this is food up there. Uh, anyway, so this vine is uh, going along the, um, it's trellised along the fence here, and it makes a really good covering. Um, which was my initial interest in vines. As you can see, this fence is covered. Um, but anyway, our key feature is... Yep. Do you grow those? Is that common for you? Now, where I'm at, I gotta pay a dollar for one fig. And that's in California where they're grown. What do you think that's worth? Now, to me, this is common and not such a big deal until you come to find out it's rare and exotic. But is it? just something growing in the ditch on the side of the road along with all the rest of my other DMT plants Ooh. yeah you know acacias um, so you know when it comes to uh, we have very fine pinnate leaves on this okay very fine and um, a lot of these close to the ground have already been trashed on. Oh, but what I wanted to focus on was the vine was coming all the way up. See, like, here's the very tip of just this, of just this one. This is a whole new vine. It's great because we got all these beautiful vines growing up. It, I mean, it's like 70 feet tall up there. It's going. I mean, it ain't about to stop. Oh, yeah, we're in the redwoods, by the way, too. And uh, here is another, uh, while we're on the subject, these are... Uh, um, Eucalyptus and Acacias. All of these are implanted by uh, stupid people basically to take over your local growth and then they worry and wonder why these things happen. But for me and you, uh, you should learn to enjoy because this is straight food for the gods and if you can figure it out then you might be a very blessed individual.